Hi everyone and welcome to Positively Kimmy. I am Kimmy. If you are new here, welcome. This is a safe space. And if you're one of my returning subscribers and my besties, hi guys, how are you? I hope you're all having an amazing day. Welcome to What's Up Wednesday. As you might be able to tell by the thumbnail, it hasn't been a great week. So I want to let you know a little bit about what's going on. And this way you get to know a little bit more about me and my life and I get to you can tell me about you and we can form that bond and that friendship that I know I have with a lot of you so with that being said I'm gonna get comfy I'm gonna back up whoops sorry in my chair pull you a little closer and get comfortable so this was not a great week for me first of all um I lost my dad 12 years ago yesterday which was Tuesday of the 22nd, no, the 21st of August. And his birthday was August 18th. So those are very hard days for me. And this week in August, for me and my family are very difficult. He was very well loved. He was an amazing man. And I miss him with all of my heart. So um, it's been a bad week because of that. However, my nephew had the, um, just turned 21 on August 22nd. So it's very difficult <laughs> when you're grieving, <laughs> when this first happened, and even now, to celebrate a birthday when you're grieving. And it was hard then, but we still had a party for my nephew at the time. He was 11 years old. 10 years old. This happened in 2012. He's 21 now. Um, and it's still hard every year. And he knows and he understands. You know, he's a great kid. And he's not your typical 21-year-old. He doesn't drink. He doesn't smoke. He's a really, really good kid. And his birthday just is the little bit of light that we need at this difficult time in my family. So for that reason, it wasn't a great week and I've been extremely quiet. So for those of you I have not reached out to, that was the reason. I don't want to put a damper on anyone else's day with my BS, okay? So that was a bad thing. But um, I decided I was going to have a garage sale and I was going through a lot of my makeup because I need to declutter. And I have a lot of new things that I just don't gravitate towards. I don't grab, but I'm so attached to them that it was really difficult and it was causing me a lot of anxiety. And I know that might sound stupid to a lot of you, um, excuse me, who do not have that problem uh, getting rid of stuff. But And I usually don't, oh, excuse me, when it comes to anything but my makeup. When it comes to my makeup, I just am so attached to either the packaging or how pretty something is, even if I don't use it. But I just have a lot of it and I really don't gravitate towards it. I have it up on the site Macari, um, but they charge shipping. So I want like $5 for a palette um, that's gently used, only been swatched, maybe not even opened yet. So I'm not asking a lot of money. I don't know that I'll get what I'm asking for at a garage sale, but I have to try. So that's going to be, I think, the end of this month, beginning of next month. I think it should be at the beginning of the month because people get their checks at the end of the month and the beginning of the month. And this way they don't have a chance to spend all their money and they can come to my garage sale and spend their money there. So that's what I'm thinking. Um, also, um, what else is going on? I went to the pulmonologist. They gave me a rescue inhaler because I do have asthma and my insurance company won't pay for it. So I am arguing with them about that at the moment. And I have to also go for a breathing test. So those are the things, the really big things that are sticking out to me right now. Um, let's see. I don't know anything else that's happened this week because it's just been a really sad week for me and, um, I haven't really done much. I've just been being a couch potato and staying in to myself for the most part, but I loved my dad and I have to tell you guys the nicest story about him if you don't mind. When I was about 13 years old, we went, we used to go all the time to go fishing when I was younger 
And then we would go to McDonald's smelling like fish. He made me bait my own hook and all that other stuff. Um, I go to McDonald's smelling like fish and then he'd take me to the food store and we'd go food shopping. But this one day we were just taking a ride in the car together and we were talking and it was during the time of my birthday. It was when the leaves had started to change just before my birthday or around my birthday. And he said to me, he's like, Kimmy, do you know why the leaves change in October? And I was like, no, daddy, why? And he said, because that's God's way of wishing you a happy birthday. So that's how amazing my dad was. And he is missed dearly every day. And I don't want this to be a downer. I really don't. Um, I got some Timu stuff in today. And I'm so excited about it. I just filmed a Timu video that I will have posted on Timu Tuesdays. So let's not get it twisted. It's still going to be posted on a Tuesday. And I said in the end of that video that I was going to show you the decal my sister made for me. And I forgot to do that. So I'm going to get it now and show you guys that. So in my last team haul, I got decals for my sister's birthday, which is September 2nd, and I gave it to her already. <laughs> and that night she had to try it, so she made one on my shirt. And look at how good this came out. Look at that. She did such a good job. I think she should do these and just to get decals, iron-ons, whatever you want to call them, and make shirts. And I think she could sell them, and I love 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 this and i'm so excited that she did this for me and it came with a smaller one that she put on a pair of my ripped capris because we weren't sure how it was going to work out but now she's doing the decals and she does a lot of crafting and stuff like that so this was a really good buy and she really loved it so the birthday present went over amazing and i have a new decal for her in the next timu video that i wanted and um yeah so she made me this and I love it. And I will wear it all year long because it came from my best friend. So with that being said, be happy, be healthy, be blessed. And most of all, be positively you because there's no one else quite like you. And that makes me so incredibly happy. Thank you for joining me. Love you guys.